Hello, um, I'm doing another little video. It is a Firefox, it's not a Firefox video, it's a notepad video of my notepad drawer. So, right, this is the first notepad in the drawer. It's a Hello Kitty one. I think this is from Modes for You. I've mentioned them quite a few times in my videos. Front pa first few pages of that. The next section's that. Then you've got those ones. Oh no, they've got two and four, so you can write, use them for writing letters. And the last one. So this one's kind of looks like, because of like, it's got like a little cut on line, so it kind of looks like it could be like an RSVP. But yeah, so that's one pa notebook. I really like that one, it's so adorable. I've got this one, which is just style notes, which I got at the. Oh, what's that thing it else called? Ideal Home Show a few years ago, the Ideal Home Show. I got that. And I've got a random pucker pad, which I use just for when I write letters, but I really don't write very many letters. I still owe Joshua Laporte a letter, don't I? He, if he's watching this, I will send it to you eventually. It is in my in tray to be done, which I will show you in my next video, because I'm going to do a video in a minute of like a tour of my desk, because I've been wanting to do that for ages, so I'm going to do that in a second. So, right. okay, now I've got the Dodo blank book. I, I was bought this as a present by my friend Steph and I haven't actually written who it belongs to or anything but anyway, it's really lovely paper I use it for like making shopping lists and stuff if I'm like, if I don't want to take my fire packs with me I write a shopping list on this, a piece of this paper and take it with me this is a really pretty notebook I would love to maybe like cut out the pages and then hole punch them with my fire packs maybe I don't think Lord Dodo would approve, maybe. <laughs> anyway, now I've got this notepad that Kat gave me. It's so adorable. I really love this. It's really cute. I haven't used it though, because the thing of me in notebooks is that I find them too cute to use. And inside it's got a little smile. And it's just got some nice little paper that says Rose Garden on at the top. So it's just really, like, really adorable. It's just like perfect handbag notebook. But I don't, I just so useless at using notepads because I don't I don't like to view in them <laughs> I'm silly I know and I've got these little notepads like this one is Alice in Wonderland themed one page is like that the other pages are like that they're so cute I've got quite a few of these another Alice in Wonderland theme one one page is like that the other pages like that I use these for making little lists in my file packs and I hole punch them and put them in. Then a Peter Pan one. There's a little Tinkerbell. So I'll just remove the reflective cover, then you'll be able to see. Tinkerbell and Peter Pan. And there's one. And then number two. They all say really random things on, like they say party time is coming. I hope a big dream. This one says... Angel Skip, Fairy Tale World, and hope this special day will be filled with happiness. They all say really strange things like that, but then they are Japanese, I guess. So, you know, what do you expect? This is just all cardboard in here, it's just like um, card for making dividers and stuff. Here's another one. This one's another Alice in Wonderland. Do you get the idea I like Alice in Wonderland? There you go. You might have remember seeing these in my old Firefox. I've not been using them in my most recent Firefox, just due to the fact that I haven't gone to it. I've got a little Snoopy address book, which I might actually use and put my addresses in. Just because it would be useful to have an address book separate from my Firefox, and then I can, you know. I've got this, which I won from Anita Lim, and I use it for like if I'm going shopping, like here's a shopping list for Christmas that was. I just wrote it list in it. It's a really nice notepad. But yeah, I just use this for making this. It's leather. It's really nice. And then I've got this notepad which I bought for my ooh, pocket zipped molden to put in the back pocket because it's got like a perfect pocket for just sliding a notepad like this in. And because I bought it, I bought a few more other notepads just because I was assuming oh I'm going writing it every day and I never did I bought these and they're so cute I got these from Accessorize ages ago so they won't sell them anymore 
but they were cute when I lasted. Um, someone sent me this, I don't remember who it was, but some lovely person sent me a little pink moleskin notepad. Moleskin? So I can't see. And then another lovely person sent me another little pretty pink moleskin. Completely different pattern as that one. And they match. They're just two different sizes, which is cute. And that one fits in the Mold and Zip Compact, which I'm selling, I think. Or well, I am selling, I decided. And then I got this which is a checklist and what I do is I've been ripping out the pages and using them in five packs but I didn't really use them. On top it's got to-do list and then on the bottom it's got one to five and then you can just make up whatever you want. And the final notepad I've got in here is a page chase notepad which I've had for years and it's just got little bits of sushi and stuff on it and it's really cute. So that is my notebooks collection. Let's put them all back quickly. I don't really use any of them to be honest. I'll just try and show you the draw. There you go, notebook draw. There you go. That is the notebook draw. So I hope you've enjoyed seeing my little world of notebooks. And that is the end of the video. Bye.